Hello friends, welcome to Testing Shala YouTube channel. In this video, we will be learning about 10 tough interview questions that would be asked in your software testing jobs. Also, you will be learning how to answer these 10 tough interview questions to get the best software testing jobs. Before moving further, if you have visited Testing Shala YouTube channel for the first time, please click on subscribe button and click on bell notification so that all our future videos related to software testing will be in your inbox that would help you to enhance your software testing skills. So let us move on to understand what are those 10 tough interview questions that can be asked in your software testing job interviews. The first question they may ask is why do you choose software testing as your career? This is very tough question because they wanted to understand do you have any passion about working on software testing or someone has just pushed you into this career ends you are working on this area or maybe down the line after two or three years you maybe wanted to move on to development team or business analyst or product owner right they just wanted to see your passion your interest whether you wanted to really continue in the software testing or you have 100% passion on software testing and you are putting all the energy, all the hard work in uh, software testing fields. Hence, you should answer this question in very clear and crisp and calm manner that your passion about software testing and how you love about software testing and what are the things you have taken up to enhance your skills in software testing, you may need to answer in a right step-by-step uh, -step manner so that interviewer will be able to understand, yes, you are really passionate about software testing and you are looking a great career in software testing field. I hope you understood how to answer this question. Then let us move on to understand the second tough interview question is, what can you tell me what are the few interesting defects or bugs you have found out name few and explain this is very important because being a tester in your career you might have logged hundreds of defects right you might have logged hundreds of defects and every defect uh, will be interesting for you but you cannot go and tell all the hundred defects here in the interview. So what you need to do is you need to pick up very interesting defects that has really brought lot of validation that really really got good appreciation from the product management or management team. You have found out really interesting defect because of those defects some of the requirements itself got changed or because of defects there is a change request has been raised so that coming releases those requirements will be implemented. Just look into this area in answering it, this question, because it is not just you tell some priority one defect or priority two defects. No, that is not the thing you wanted to answer here. You need to answer here in such a way that the defect which you logged, it brings lot of value addition to the project. And because of that, it saved a lot of efforts or it got really good appreciation from the product management or leadership team or it brings in new requirement because you logged in a defect. That's how you need to answer this question. Then let's move on to the third interview question is can you name three challenges faced in your current project in your testing area and how did you overcome? Again, this question is also a similar question where you should be able to come up with the top challenges, top three challenges. Let's say if you worked on any Nishi technology or Nishi uh, functional area, then learning new things all together as a fresh project and put in so much effort and zero knowledge, right? How did you overcome those zero knowledge and how did you build yourself as a knowledge expertise that is one challenge right or maybe you might have come across new tools being used in your project and uh, integration of those new tools into your existing test management tools was a re was really a challenge then how did you uh, overcome that or uh, 
some example like uh, these days lot of attrations are happening in the lower level of uh, testers then how did you build the knowledge base even the huge attrition was there still you are able to manage the great things in the, your testing project right i am just uh, call, calling out three challenges you can uh, think through yourself and identify the best challenges you need to cuz here it is not just uh, some uh, project some challenges which you need to highlight here no you think through whatever you feel around the best uh, challenges you need to call that out here then fourth is what is your view towards automated tests as you worked on manual testing because this is a question when it will be asked is if the company which they wanted to hire you uh, they are looking for automation roles and they are interested in your profile but if you are showing your interest in automation eager to learn in automation then they may consider your profile for that role because you are good in all the aspects except automation but they wanted to give a opportunity for you they wanted to give a opportunity for you to learn automation hence they would be asking this kind of questions hence when you are answering these questions you should talk about you are interested on, on automation testing what are the benefits you get out of the automation testing then start marketing that showcase you are interested in automation testing not just manual testing because over the long run having a automation knowledge is really helps to have a proper career in software testing area because just having a manual testing means somewhere the down the line your testing career will go down hence you treat this question as a very important questions and start articulating you are interested on in automation testing your way of advantages or disadvantages have you tried any tools earlier in your project or have you learned any tool start uh, discussing in this way so that you, sh you are trying to showcase your interest towards automation test so let's move on to understand the fifth interview question any time have a conflict with the development team on the test results this is uh, more on uh, handling the difficult situation or handling the conflict situation how, how how good you are in managing that how good you are in managing the uh, differences of, of opinion between the development team or product team or uh, ba team right as a tester because you will be interacting with your day to day work with all these folks all these teams then if you are not managing those people well well good enough then uh, it would be very challenges as a tester hence the interviewer would like to understand how good you are in interacting with uh, these people and you should be able to come up with few example to tell how you have managed that kind of situation you should be able to come up with few examples to tell to the interviewer that these are the situations you might have come across on day to day basis and you have managed in a different way and you have managed successfully in convincing the development team or you come up with a valid data point to showcase your version to the development team to solve the conflicts with the development team somehow you should articulate and start conveying the message to the interviewer you are not a problem creator person you are a go to go person with anybody and your communication skills are very good and you are able to communicate with the other groups as well in a cool and calm manner and with a effective methods this is how you should answer for this question i am hoping you are really enjoyed watching this uh, software testing 10 tough interview questions video i hope uh, this video was very useful for you in preparing your interview questions and answers if you like this video please click on like button and if you have visited testing shala youtube channel for the first time then please click on subscribe and bell notification so that all our future videos related to software testing will be in your inbox that would help you to enhance your software testing skills thanks for watching this video bye for now take care